Hi, this is Courtney with Montessori Free School Preschool. In today's video, you will see my daughter using the spindle work. Now in the traditional Montessori classroom, this will look like a tray that has several slots for the numbers one through 10. In these slots, children can put spindles or something that looks like a wooden dowel into the slot. It helps them to associate the written numeral with the physical quantity. Instead of using a tray or a spindle box, we are going to be using jars. These are simple spice jars that we save and then we write the numbers on them and then put them in order from 1 through 9 or 1 through 10, depending on which numbers you're working on. We're going to use popsicle sticks, which can be purchased at any craft store or perhaps Dollar Tree. And this is going to help her to associate the number that's written on the jar with the physical number in the jar. One thing to remember is that whatever number your child is working on, that's how many sticks or spindles you're going to put out. For instance, she's working on the numbers 1, 2, and 3. If you add together 1, 2, and 3, you get the number 6. So I'd only put 6 popsicle sticks into the container for her to count. If I were to give her a number like 10 or 12, this would confuse her because once she counted the spindles, she would still have some left over, but no spindle boxes or jars to put them in. So once again, this is called control of error. This helps the child to check their own work. So if they're working on the numbers one through five, which is what you'll see in the video, I'm going to put out 15 popsicle sticks because if you add one, two, three, four, and five, it equals 15. This way she knows that she's doing her work correctly if there's no popsicle sticks left after she's filled jars one through five. I hope you enjoyed this video and please continue watching other videos in the Montessori Free School Preschool series. Thank you. You could just do that. You could do that. That's the same one. And this one's sticky. One. What comes after one? Two. two. Uh huh. What comes after two? Three. Mm -hmm. What comes after three? Four. What comes after three? I mean, four. Five. Okay, and our five is upside down, so I'm just going to oh. take it and, and turn it around. There we go. All right. Well, so we're gonna go. we're practicing putting the spindles in. Okay. So here's your spindles. Okay. How many spindles go in the number one jar? One. Okay. One. Two. Go ahead. Three. You did it. Thank you. Thank you for that. Mm -hmm. 